Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to convert a graph which has been made in a Word document or an Excel sheet to be converted into a image. This may be required for many reasons. One example is during publication, they require the images to be in a JPEG or a TIFF format of a proper resolution. In order to do that, let me show you how a graph looks like in a Word document. In a Word document, the graph is totally editable in which you can see and change colors, the heading, the category fonts, etc. Let us say you are choosing a graph of this particular size. You right click on this graph and copy it. And then when you paste it, you can see there is an arrow below the paste button on the top left corner. When you click on that, you can see the third option is a picture. When you click on that, it gets converted into a picture. See, you can not edit any of these bars. Now right click on this picture and then click save as picture. And then you can save it in a particular location. Change the format to JPEG and give a title and save. This is how you convert a bar chart into a figure. The same thing can be done in PowerPoint also. So when we open a PowerPoint, you can open a new PowerPoint and you can copy the graph and then you can paste it in the PowerPoint. Now here you can also use the size of the PowerPoint screen. You can increase the font size so that it looks decent. You can double click on any of these numbers and then you can see that you get a option format data labels under that if you go to the number section you can see the category called number select that and it will ask you how many decimals do you want it to be so you can do that for each category so you make it as a number and you can see that all the images have been converted into two decimals you can right click on this particular image and you see that in PowerPoint, save as picture directly comes instead of converting and pasting which you have to do in the Word document. You click on save as picture and then you go to the desktop or whichever place you want to save and you can see that the TIFF format is also available here and then you can name it and save it. Hope this helps you convert the images appropriately for your publication.